Hello everyone, uh, welcome to another video, this time coming back at you from the regular setting in the office, and I'm going to be opening up my second Topps Chrome Star Wars box here. Uh, I have not posted the video of the first one yet, that should be going up today, and this one will be going up later this week. The first box, I only had one numbered parallel, and the autograph was so-so. Mm, somebody I didn't have before, so I guess that's one positive. There are a few scratched cards, again, with Topps quality control being uh, piss poor this year on their Chrome products. Hopefully this box... We will avoid that issue, but I doubt it. I do hope I get more than one um, numbered parallel this time. Let's go ahead and take out all these packs. Go ahead and put the box back here in the background. Actually, I guess I don't even it won't even show so. Gotta play mat out because the, the vinyl backdrop is getting a little messy. That's what happens when you have a white background. Any little thing shows up on it, ink spots from pens dropping and what have you. And just items that have dirt on the surface. All right, so here we go. Dritus, Bucket, Princess Leia, that's a regular one, and then a Journey of Grogu insert. Put my base cards over here, separate my piles for the different inserts. Uh, Dooku, Leia, and upside down for some reason, Maz Kanata. It's not numbered or anything and then another journey of grogu insert dark ray dio upside down c3po and a second sister refractor So Manga Madness. So Darth Vader, a Baru, or Owen Lars with a nice print line scratch across the top. So there we go with the same issues before. Manga Madness. I don't have that one, so at least that's good. And a Refractor, Boba Fett. Luckily, I believe I already have Owen Lars, so I don't need that one for the base set. Anakin, Cad Bane, Obi-Wan Kenobi, and the Journey of Grogu. Alright, Salacious B. Crumb, Chewbacca, Quinlan Voss with print line. And a Jabba the Hut Refractor. Chrysanthemum. Ahsoka. Upside down Emperor Palpatine. 
and a refractor mall. Getting some pretty good refractors, characters. Uh, Baru Lars, Luthen Rao, with some, I think that'll come off though. Boss Nass, and a Journey of Grogu. Let's see. Microfiber cloth. Nope. Nice uh, scratch or whatever on that card. Have him already, so that's not such a big deal. Alright, this has a thick card, so it may be the auto. Uh, or maybe numbered, so we'll hold that one off. It is backwards, so it probably is the auto. Sugar, sugar. <laughs> Kylo Ren, Echo, Grief Karga, and this one I don't have. Farm Boy, Monikers, Luke Skywalker. Rogu, Cobb Thanth, uh, Tam Rivora, and Tora Daza from both from Resi Resistance animated show that I think lasted one season before it got canceled. It was a Disney Plus uh, series. Sanara San, Sira Junda, Manga Madness, and a Grogu. DJ Ray, Sabalba, and 3PO monikers. Maz Kanata Refractor in the back. Sabine Wren. BD1. Kira. And the Maz Kanata. Fourth Sister. K2SO. Bail Organa. And 3PO. Refractor. Wrecker. Poe. Ketsu Onyo. Oh, and this one I don't have. Also, Sheath Palpatine. Darth Sidious. Jar Jar Binks, General Hux, Shmi, and uh, Emperor Palpatine Refractor. So far, only uh, one thick stock card. So, it's this is going to be another box with one numbered pair. Now, if it's a good autograph, I don't care. Uh, I'd be very happy with one awesome numbered autograph. Omega. Mandalorian, Babu Frick, and it's Journey of Grogu card, which I have already. Uh, nope, wait, there's a, is there a number? Yeah, that's, is, it, is there ink to it though? No, it's Admiral Akbar, so there's, there's a parallel. Inquisitor, Crosshair, uh, one of the Aqua or whatever, Refractor, Akbar, and Hunter. 
he is going to be, I believe, out of one ninety nine. It's a trap. It's a trap. <laughs> See, yeah, 194 out of 199. Go ahead and grab him. So it's looking more and more like that other card is my auto. And we'll put the strack bar back here. Maybe we can pull one more. Jen Urso, Riva, Manga Madness, and double insert pack, and a moniker's uh, Rex, which I believe I already have. On Solo, uh, this guy. Toro Daza again, and Ezra Bridger Refractor. Three packs left before the uh, we get back to that one I put aside. Uh, Claude, there's our 40th anniversary Return of the Jedi insert R2-D2. This time it's not scratched. It's always a good thing. Uh, Refractor Tusken Warrior. Finnick, Supreme Leader, Tech, and Grogu. All right, in the last pack. Padme, uh, Niku Voza, Janna, and a Refractor Han Solo. All right, go from the back, Journey of the Grogu. Yoda and let's it's ah uh, it's a fourth sister and it's not numbered it just is on thicker cardstock <sighs> so another so so mediocre to low end autograph which I guess you should expect out of these products. Um, and at least it's, again, it's somebody I don't have. If I can read the name on the back of this. Rhea uh, Hal Halstead? I'm not sure. It's hard to read with my eyesight. Actually, I have a loop here. Let's see. Rhea Rice. Rice Skelt, Rice, I don't know. The last name is a bit hard to pronounce. But that's my auto. So, uh, pretty much followed the same as the first box. One numbered parallel and one autograph of a, I think, Obi-Wan. This is from the Obi-Wan series. He's an actor in that series. Uh, the, the inserts were pretty good. A lot of cards I didn't have already, so that's a good thing. Not a lot of scratches this time, which also is another good thing. So uh, thanks for watching, everyone. Uh, if you don't mind hitting that like button, subscribing to the channel, drop a comment. See, Let me know if you bought any of this, if you hit anything big, if you had the same issue with print lines and scratches on your cards, and so on. Appreciate it. Until next time, goodbye.